Well, Jeff and Susie, tonight I spoke with a gas station clerk who had an assault style rifle pointed right at his chest. Tonight he recounted the terrifying and bizarre moments. I was like in shock. I didn't know what to do. And he yelled at me again. He's like, give me your money. And then he just aimed the gun towards my chest. Raul Maria was so shocked when this guy walked into his gas station with an assault type rifle and then just walked out. He thought maybe it was a joke. We thought it was a joke. We thought it was a fake gun. But when 22 year old Gonzalo Barajas returned a second time demanding cash, Mario emptied the till and gave him $400. Barajas took off. Over the next two hours, police say Barajas would point his assault style rifle at 20 victims at businesses from Santa Ana to Tustin before police could finally catch him around 4 o'clock. I just heard a lot of commotion going on. There's some guy outside with a shotgun or an assault rifle, and I didn't think it was real. Police say he pointed his rifle at employees in 10 different locations, repeatedly pulling the trigger. Then they say Barajas led them on a pursuit from Tustin to Santa Ana. Only when Barajas' mother, at the urging of Santa Ana detectives, called her son and told him to turn himself in, did he surrender. We tried to speak with her at her Santa Ana home. She and her family asked us to leave. Barajas surrendered without a fight in the middle of this Santa Ana street. Police arrested him. Luckily, his rifle was not loaded. Nobody was hurt. You're obviously thinking the worst thing, you know, worst case scenario, preparing yourself for it. And fortunately, um, that didn't happen. Yeah, very fortunately, amazing. Nobody was hurt. No shots ever fired. Brajas is being held right now in the Santa Ana jail. He faces a slew of charges.